So, here we go then. Barcelona against Manchester United. I'm John Champion and today's co-commentator is Jim Beckley. paper in front of me at least as a friendly doesn't strike me as such I didn't really do friendlies myself I think if you go out and you cross that white line then you have to compete and you have to give it everything you've got and I'm sure both sets of supporters will want to see that too today how would you categorize this particular rivalry neighborly narky or just downright nasty um, it can be a little nasty at times but there's just always a, a fierce intensity about it a fierce rivalry so you, you know you're going to get a really passion game of football two teams that really do want to win it seconds out round one here we go Barcelona against Manchester United Pedro and Messi Here's Iniesta. Iniesta makes a run through the middle. Iniesta oh, shoots. He wants to get a cross in from here. Now through to Shabby. Chance here. He got the man there. That's a free kick. Iniesta. Here's Messi. Messi. Kicked off. Surely he can't miss from here. Xavi. A goal for Barcelona. And that's the opener for this game. De Gea. Maybe was incited by his own defence there. Just look at the way the ball sneaked through that defensive line. And I don't think he could pick it up until it was way too long. to wait long for the first goal Pedro here's Xavi Cesc Fabregas on the ball Iniesta creator of one goal already here's Messi to the back and Cesc Fabregas he's going on to be fair, that was tough for the keeper to handle. PK. Maserano. Xavi, who's just added his name to the score sheet. Here's Daniel Alves. Now Pedro. He tried going it alone, but without success. Well, look. I don't think he can say he didn't have enough support in that instance because he's got to get his head up more and see what's around him. If you're going to keep your head down looking at the ball, you're not going to see the options, and that was a bit selfish for me. They were so nearly punished for their mistake. Here's Van Persie. Rooney thumps it long the ball is with Pedro Pedro is bearing down on goal Sergio Busquets
shoots here. What a reprieve that was. And Van Persie. Here's Nani. Pedro. The referee blows his whistle to signal half time. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom with the lead at half time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. It's a cagey game, this one. Plenty to fascinate the spectators, though. The score is 1 0. So, off we go then, with the second half. Here's Iniesta. Iniesta making inroads deep into opposition territory. Nani is in position to intercept. Cleverly. Iniesta. Messi is making his way forward. Messi really has the confidence and skill to be able to hold the ball up like that until support arrives a little sooner. And just maybe there he overdid it slightly and should have released it because the support was arriving quickly. Mascherano plays it long. Now through to Messi. Neymar has got hold of him. He's not taking any risks there. Raphael knocks it forward. Iniesta on the ball. Says Fabregas. Sergio Busquets pumps it upfield. Well, he was given the time and room initially to hold on to the ball, but eventually he was squeezed that bit harder and the task became too much. I think he's got to be a little quicker in his distribution then and get others into the match. Messi shoots! That should have been 2-0. Well, he's definitely kept the side in the game then. That's really good positioning. They could have doubled their lead there. Xavi has teed up this corner. Could be a goal here, it's the ball. Oh, that should have been it. What a huge let-off that was. Conceding them would really have left the momentum to climb. Xavi will drive this corner in. And they escape imminent danger. Mascherano. Cesc Fabregas on the ball. Cesc Fabregas is charging through the centre. Cleverly is all over him. Carrick cuts out what was really a sloppy pass. There's something going on down at the bench. I think it's going to be a substitution. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. The forward push gains momentum. Well, time is running out. They need to get the ball in field. We're into the last 
five minutes. Manchester United with what could be a last throw of the dice. So that's it. It's all over. This could be put down as a victory for a set of defenders who all kept their focus for the full 90 minutes. Well, once they got that goal, I just thought they were very dogged in seeing the game through. And that clean sheet, you know, key to the win.